underestimate Ebony Jones at your peril, I would say, to those boxers out there. We move on to the weather. Sam Fraser's here. Um, it's been quite mild, hasn't it, really? It has been very mild, and it's staying mild as we head into tomorrow. Let's take a look at our pictures for today and a fishy breakfast for this seal as the sun struggled to break the cloud at Leon Solent. Thanks to Barry Webb for that. And in Hythe, the seagulls there forming a guard of honour, protecting the poppies ahead of Armistice Day. Very well spotted, Jan Sutton. Yes, it was a bright and mild day today. Temperatures up at around 14 or 15 Celsius, so very pleasant for November. Here's how things looked in Wareham, thanks to our weather watcher for that. Some very atmospheric skies. All set to change for tomorrow. We're going to see a wet and windy start to the day after a wet and windy night, but some brighter spells later, some showers on their way too. Let's take a look at tonight then, and winds picking up, cloud increasing ahead of this band of rain, which will track east through the course of the night. Some heavy spells of rain on that, persistent too. Under the cloud and the wind and the rain, temperatures don't drop out of double figures, so exceptionally mild tonight. On to tomorrow morning then, and a wet and windy start to the day. As the day wears on, the uh, first pulse of rain moves off. We'll start to see some showers making their way into our patch. So sunshine and showers through the afternoon, breezy, temperatures up at around 13 Celsius, so staying mild. Out on the inshore waters tomorrow, winds are south, veering west for a time, 5 to 7. Visibility is good, occasionally poor, and the sea state is moderate or rough. On to tomorrow night then and a respite as the front clears away. We're going to see a dry night, some clear skies, so temperatures well, way down on where they'll have been. So quite a chilly night to come, single figures as you can see. Looking ahead then to Thursday and uh, well we've got a front out to the west that's going to affect western parts of the UK. I think we're quite well favoured to stay dry for much of the day, perhaps a few showers uh, but some good spells of sunshine too so not too bad for us. Temperatures up in the low teens once again. Here's the outlook then for the next few days. For tomorrow as I say it's a sunshine and showery kind of day. A better day on Thursday as we head into Friday a deep area of low pressure approaches uh, and that's going to spell some rain quite heavy and persistent perhaps even accompanied by a rumble of thunder too and it stays blustery as we head into the weekend too some brighter spells but you are definitely going to need your brolly